Are you serious? Are you very serious? Well, it's getting that serious. L.A. Marzulli is going to join me today at 12 noon Eastern to talk about how serious the North Korea situation is becoming. Now the, we've just got confirmation the United States has just tested an unarmed intercontinental ballistic missile amid the North Korean tensions. The U.S. Air Force conducted this scheduled test of an unarmed Minuteman III intercontinental ballistic missile early this morning in California. The missile was launched at 2.10 a.m. local time from the Air Force of North Vandenberg Air Force Base located 130 miles northwest of Los Angeles. While not a, a response to recent North Korean actions, the test demonstrates the United States nuclear enterprise is safe, secure, effective, and ready and able to deter, detect, defend against attacks on the United States of America and its allies, according to a statement, written statement by the Air Force. While today's intercontinental ballistic missile test by the United States Air Force is not a retaliation to North Korea's intercontinental ballistic missile test last Friday, it comes amid growing tensions with North Korea. The Pentagon has expressed certain concern that North Korea poses a danger to the commercial aircraft region. Uh, so U.S. officials confirmed yesterday that a commercial airliner flew past the location where North Korea's latest intercontinental ballistic missile would have landed. Less than 10 minutes later in the Sea of Japan. So in other words, it came within 10 minutes of, a, of an airliner. July 28th, the intercontinental ballistic missile by North Korea was the longest flight of a ballistic missile in the country's history. And uh, with tremendous capabilities, folks, in direct response to North Korea, the United States flew two supersonic B-1 bombers with their Japanese and South Korean allies in the North Korean peninsula on Saturday. North Korea launched its first intercontinental ballistic missile test on July 4th with leader Kim Jong-un calling it a gift to the United States on its Independence Day. Now, Minutemen missiles have been regularly tested at the Vandenberg base, and today's test is the fourth this year. These missiles travel 4,200 miles across the Pacific to land on a targeted area, according to the Associated Press. The Air Force also conducted a test of a missile interceptor from Vandenberg in May that destroyed a mock warhead in the Pacific. And so these are the situations right now. It's getting intense. It's getting intense. It's getting very intense. I want you to pray because uh, there's a lot of troop movements going everywhere around the world. Are we on the edge of World War III? Is this what this prophetic sign of the apocalypse, the coming apocalypse, is this solar eclipse, the great American solar eclipse, is it a prophetic sign of great woe and conflict coming upon America? Give your life to Jesus Christ. We're running out of time.